What's going on world? I'm Wesley from A Connection TV, the network, the one channel on YouTube, where we actually adopt similar connections and spot our differences. And hold on one second, let me let me make sure I know it's uh Hey <laughs> Oh bitch better have my money. Well this ain't that particular video. I want to talk about Beyonce releasing a new song called Die With You. Hmm. Now, I was at a buddy's surprise birthday party yesterday. Shout out to everybody that went. It was actually a good turnout. You know one of those parties that you go to and you hope it's going to be a good turnout, but only two motherfuckers are there on time. And then two more motherfuckers come like an hour after. And then the rest of the crowd don't get there until like 12, 30, 1 o'clock. That's kind of like how it was last night. <laughs> It's one of those situations where you look around and you're like, where the rest of these, where they at? Where they, is that coming? Oh, they, did you invite them? <laughs> did, you sit, did you hit send on the Evite? Like, like Kenny and Nene? Anyways, Beyonce releases a new song and I was at the party last night and you know, the gays were, you know, trying to talk some trash against your girl. My girl and your girl representing the Beehive, Beyonce saying, oh, she tried to play the piano and oh, this and oh, that. I'm like, come on now. Come on now. Come on now. Soon as she starts off the song, she's doing a lot of falsetto runs and riffs. And I'm just like, oh, shit, Beyonce singing again. Oh, shit. And y'all know what I mean. What I mean by that, if y'all don't know what I mean, because some of y'all out there, y'all watch, y'all y'all just want everything to be positive about Beyonce. And I'm a Beyonce fanatic. Like, I don't, I don't want to, you know, donate blood to Beyonce or, you know, take care of Blue Ivy or be the godfather of Blue Ivy or no crazy shit like that. I just respect the girl. She's a phenomenal performer. She sings her ass off. She has sass and, 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 and charisma on stage. I just, I love Beyonce. Beyonce has not released an album where I didn't like more than seven or nine songs on the album. And it actually quite just, well, I don't like every song on every album, but she's that artist, okay? You can't, you can't hate on Beyonce, but a lot of people do because she is that artist. For whatever particular reason, a lot of the gays or and a lot of people, but a lot of gays hate on Beyonce because, you know, people, I guess people typically think that if you're gay, you just love Beyonce. But no, not every gay person loves Beyonce. And it was proven last night at the thing when they was trying to discredit the girl for playing the piano. Since when Beyonce knew how to play the motherfucking piano. And then they was, they was analyzing the video, her fingers not moving. <laughs> oh, gosh, cut it out. God damn it. She was playing the piano, goddammit. Now, I'ma tell you now, if she wasn't playing piano and she was uh, piano sinking, then that's sad, Beyonce, that's sad. You ain't gotta do that. But uh, rumor has it is that she she painted the, the painting that was behind her and she was playing the piano. I'm like, I don't know if she can paint and I don't know if she can play the piano. We ain't never see this child play the piano, but at the end of the day, she played it on that video I saw. And you know what? It's it's. I think you might need to get the subscription for Title, y'all. I think your your cheap ass might just need to get the subscription because Title ain't motherfucking playing. You can't find that video on YouTube no more. You can't even find the music on SoundCloud. You can't tell me. And this is something that I don't understand. And for other music companies and things of that nature, all the music that's released online, Title ain't playing no motherfucking games. You can't tell me Jay Z play paid fifty six million dollars for Title. And they're going to let y'all just run away with his exclusive shit. And he got people paying monthly payments on this shit. That's what I was thinking. I was like, why the hell I'm going to pay monthly payments when the music going to be online? Fuck if it is. Fuck if it is. The music ain't online. You can't find <laughs> You can't find that shit nowhere. They done took that shit down. And you know what? I hope it stays that way. Because if I do decide to pay for a title... Which I don't know if I am. But if I do decide to pay for title, I want exclusivity to the fullest. But that's just me. I don't know. What did y'all think about Beyonce playing that piano in that song? That song was off the hook. It was reminiscent of One Plus One. Reminiscent. And somebody was saying that um, um, it, was, it was a remake of one of her other songs. I was like, y'all just trying it with the girl. Let the girl do her. She is phenomenal in her own right. And give her her... Props, okay? Bow down, bitches. Let me know what y'all thought about the video. I thought it was hot. 
Shout out to Beyonce, shout out to the stars of Tidal, and shout out to Zay Z for being smart. <laughs>